green tea catechins lower cholesterol and improve blood sugar regulation. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, catechins in green tea have been proven to help your body burn fat and help people lose weight. This is now well documented. It's the, and it's not the caffeine, because if you give people decaffeinated green tea that has enough catechins in it, these polyphenolic compounds from green tea, what you see is it turns, it, it increases their metabolic rate and they burn more fat by turning on their brown fat. Brown fat burns calories when you're just sitting there in a chair and gives the calories off to the environment as heat and through other mechanisms as well. What's nice about green tea catechins is unlike ephedra and other stimulants, it doesn't stimulate the central nervous system so there's no risk of seizures and heart attack and having a stroke and insomnia and irritability and all, you know, race, you know, your racing heart, tachycardia, or your blood pressure doesn't go up. So it's not a stimulant. And that's, so it's been used as a, an effective way to help people lose body fat in conjunction with exercise and the right diet. And people, you know, lose body fat quite effectively using uh, green tea catechins from decaffeinated green tea. But in 2012, we saw some additional research on catechins that we didn't know uh, were uh, what part of the health outcomes that they're getting. So this study involved patients who were overweight who also had high blood pressure. So they gave them a specific dose of catechins as a supplement from, uh, from green tea. And they found out it was also lowering their blood sugar level and their insulin level. Now this is very important for diabetics and pre-diabetics and preventing diabetes. It also helped to lower their blood pressure. These were people that had high blood pressure, it was going down. It also lowered their bad cholesterol, which is the LDL cholesterol and it raised the good cholesterol, which is the HDL cholesterol. The HDL cholesterol, we think, goes in and pulls some of the cholesterol out of the plaque in the artery wall, opens the blood vessel up again, uh, reducing risk of heart attack, stroke, other vascular problems. The problem is that you can't drink enough green tea to get the dosage of catechins that's been shown to be therapeutic in this regard. You actually need a supplement. You have to take the right dosage of catechins from decaffeinated green tea. And this, it would make sense to do that if you're a pre-diabetic, if you're already a diabetic, if you have high blood pressure, if your cholesterol is high, or if you're overweight. If you have any of these problems, you should click on the link below and read my review article on this subject because it explains the correct dosage to use so you don't waste your money on some inferior dosage. And I'll help you understand what nutrients work synergistically with catechins to give you the very best overall effect. And you'll see the scientific references on all of this so you know you're on solid foundation. So click the link below and read the article if this applies to you. In the meantime, at machinohealth.com, you can see my other research review papers and teaching materials from my live professional seminars, videos there, other resources and downloads, all created to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my research review papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references, so you'll know you're getting only evidence-based information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should use MachinoHealth.com as an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.